Hey, welcome guys. Welcome to this uh, under investigation video. So today we're looking at uh, protest number 58 of uh, this season. So this is season three. Um, so this time we are in the F3 series um, on round six, I believe. And uh, this race happened in uh, Dunnington Park. Uh, so we're lo looking at a battle uh, on lap 15. So I would, so that would be probably two thirds in the race. Um, following here, this white car in P15. And this protest is a matter of uh, car contact. So the incident will happen in a few seconds. Uh, of course, we're going to make sure that um, that we are covering all the angles required for the stewards to take the, the proper decision. Uh, yeah, so we have another, you know, the following car just right there. There's contact. Oh, that looks to be a contact. All right. Um, so first, we're going to make sure that uh, we do have a contact. Let's take the overhead cam. And definite contact right there. I mean, this is uh, clearly the nose between the tires. Um, second thing we want to take a look at is uh, you know, if, if this car was um, defending, which she is allowed to do, uh, what we're looking for is, was this car uh, making any uh, illegal defensive move, I'd say? So, let's say changing directions while uh, braking, uh, blocking, um, or is it... Uh, just like a, a racing incident. Well, uh, a, a car contact, what we are looking at right now. Uh, let's take a look from the rear chase camera. Very light contact, but those cars probably... Uh, Uh, it was a good run there. I don't see any change, sudden changes of directions. Uh, let's take a look from the cockpit from the car in front, and then we'll take a look at uh, what the car behind did. There's a lot of uh, gunk in the visor here. Sorry for that. So, of course, the normal line would have been to move to the left side to open up the corner. But I feel like uh, this car here went for a defensive move. So, braking now. And this spin happens there. So after the, this corner, I, be, I what I tend to see here is, let's say, a commitment towards defending uh, the right part of the track. There's no, I don't see any uh, sudden changes of direction. It's just, all right, so I'm not going to go there and I'm moving towards the middle of the track to defend. And then car contact. Um, all right, let's see from the car behind now.
So clearly the driver behind made his, in made his uh, intentions clear. But so what we're try we will try to determine because there's definite contact. I mean, there's no doubt about it. Um, so what those two words will take a look at in further detail is is the driver in front made a defensive move after the um, uh, the car behind made his move to the uh, to the inside. So that's the the important part here because that would be in our um, rule book something close to blocking. So we're going to capture a couple of, of other angles. So was it right to in, in reaction to the car behind? And we're already on the brakes here. All right. Well, I think I have enough for the stewards. So, uh, so yeah, I mean, uh, thank you for racing for PRL, and uh, we'll see you. Uh, we'll see you soon on the track, guys. So, uh, yeah, have fun.